Conservative MMA peeps, what's up? It's me, John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion and the MMA expert, joined by Paul F. Villarreal, my brother, and we are talking about Strike Force. It's going down. This is the heavyweight Grand Prix. This is the whole card underneath that situation or with that situation. It's in Dallas, Texas, June 18th. It's going to be on Showtime and also under card in HDNet. We love it. Now, we've talked about a lot of the fights here. And you can check out all our videos with that, with the predictions and everything. And we're going to be talking about the way it, it looked good. But I want to talk about Daniel Cormier versus Jeff Monson. That's a hot fight. Now, you've seen our videos, with, you probably have seen or you can see our, video, our videos with Daniel Cormier. Guy's great. He's hilarious. Very funny. He was mixing it up there with uh, UFC heavyweight champion Kay Velasquez. We're both at AKA at the AKA Grand Open. We have all that kind of stuff. There was all kinds of back and forth with Daniel and some of the other uh, uh, people over there. It was fantastic. We had a funny thing with him and Herschel Walker and, and um, Kay Velasquez. Anyway, forget about that. Daniel, it's great, but you should check it out. Daniel Cormier, undefeated. Okay, 7 0. Great wrestler. He's got it all going on. Now, he's facing Jeff Monson, the snowman. Now, this guy is a submission specialist, and he's still doing it, and he's getting it done. Now, the weight's about the same. The height, Cormier has a little bit more height, although in the weigh-in, although Monson was in his sandals, it looked a little bit like that. So, this is a tough one. This is a very tough one to predict. Here's the thing. I really love the complete game. Uh, if you will, in terms of the whole game. I'm not talking about like he's great and everything. I'm just talking about the whole game that Daniel brings into this situation. Cormier, I'm really high on this guy. I think he's very, he's a very, very good heavyweight, and I think he's only getting better. At the same time, his primary deal is wrestling. And when you get in there with a guy like Munson and you're doing grappling, that guy can just <laughs> submit you very, very quickly. I mean, you're talking about someone that is, you know, extremely highly skilled in submissions. So that's a tough one. That's a whole X factor that you just don't know what's going to happen. I still think, at the end of the day, Cormier gets it done. I think he's going to have more in the gas tank. I think he's going to use his wrestling defensively as well as offensively. And he also has you know, some decent strikes that he can put in this and try to keep Munson at range. If they do get locked up and it gets on the ground, watch out. It could go the other way. So I'm saying... 65-35 Cormier with the better wrestling, the defensive wrestling, and the youth and endurance on his side. But watch out because anything can happen like this in this fight. Paul, what do you think about this fight? You tell me where you come down. You know, I, I don't know a ton about Cormier. So, I, I mean, I know Jeff Monson. He's a tough dude, as you said. Real veteran. Can't submit you. Powerful guy. I've seen Cormier, you know, the footage that you've got, but I don't really know a lot about him as a fighter, so I'm going to have to defer to you on this pick. I love it. He's great. You tell me what's going on. I'm saying Cormier is going to win this thing and go to 8 0. But anything can happen in this fight, and the X factor, I mean, to, to put it to you like this, Cormier, not unlike Verdum in a way, but a little bit different, has such strong submission skills that it's almost like having a knockout punch in striking. So anything can happen with Munson, but I think Cormier understands that. I think that AKA and those guys know what's up, and I think Cormier's going to get the win. You tell me what you think. Comments below. Subscribe above. I'm John D. Villarreal, and you're watching Conservative New Media.